balance of like up and down in terms of ball, ball, strike, strike, you know, like meat, heart, heart of the plate up. That's the thing that like is going to be probably the most time consuming because like the way that I look at it, if you're developing a pitcher and the way that I was developed younger was like in and out, right? Arm side, glove side, and like working east to west. And even that was like a a grind. You know, I remember being in high school and and kind of always been someone that was throwing hard. So I focused on the middle of the plate. And then when I got to pro ball, it was really like, all right, we got to go out, in, out, in. And I remember that being a struggle. And I look at it the very same way. Like I'm probably all together 16 months maybe of like being intentional with like throwing fastballs up. Um, And as I mentioned, it's it's not going to happen overnight. It's something that I need to intentionally practice. Uh, but with my slider, um, just throughout the course of the winter, it was very consistent. It was there. Um, it was a good pitch. Got a lot of strikeouts on it. Could put it essentially where I wanted early in counts, late in counts, in the dirt. Lefties, righties didn't really matter. I'm sure my splits were relatively the same too as far as righties and lefties go. But um, it was something that was was good. And it's tough, too, because I look at it and be like, all right, well, if the slider is is probably my best pitch, well, besides like the fastball, best secondary pitch, then it's like, how much do I need the curveball? How much do I need the split? How much do I need like a changeup or something like that? And that's where I struggle with. And that's kind of the next bulleted point was like my struggle was like every single time I would go out, I was trying to like prove that I, I could do more. I could do something else. And and you guys have known me for a while now. So like, that's something that I've always kind of struggled with. 